I have a smartphone. Mm -hmm. I have a tablet. Mm -hmm. Becca has a smartphone. Mm -hmm. The kids have uh, like a, a shared smartphone that they use for games and creating stick right. bot animations and things like that. And we are now at that point where okay, we've got wall warts all over the place. <laughs> all over the place. Even to the point where it gets frustrating because some of our electrical outlets are switched. So someone will come into the room and turn off the light switch and my daughter's, oh. my daughter's phone will stop charging. Right. right? Like, that's where we're at. So wouldn't it be nice if, as you think about, you know, these gifts that you've got under the tree this year, and maybe you're just already at that point where you've all got all different devices and you need to be able to charge them, uh, where it would be really nice to have one docking station that would charge everything. <laughs> oh, that oh. would be so amazing. I would actually have plugs again. What if I told you, Jeff? Because this is, you know, I have to sound like an infomercial because that's what YouTube tells me I am. <laughs> <laughs> what if I told you, Jeff, <laughs> that we've got one that slices and dices? Uh, no, Jabiz. I would say, show me. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, Jabiz has brought out the Q7 and this one. <laughs> there's the, there's the, the infomercial voice. The Q7 as we open the box. Now, the Q7 is pretty outstanding, Jeff. It's got Qualcomm Quick Charge 2.0. Okay, how many? Is that six ports? That's six ports. Can, can I turn this into an unboxing? I'm going to actually open this up for okay. you folks. Ooh. Okay, first thing that I notice is this squiggly thing, which is in fact... Is that the technical term? Yeah, the squiggly thing. Now, keep in mind, folks, because I've seen some of the Amazon reviews that this is not the main selling point of the device. But it is a pretty cool little stand that you can stand up a couple of phones and maybe a tablet just to keep them. Oh, okay. It's just right. a little bit more organized than having right. them all laying out on the table. Right. Okay. Now, a couple of Amazon reviews are saying, oh, well, the stand is a little bit flimsy. Not the selling point. It's a stand, though. This is the stand. Okay. Plus. Comes with it. It's a bonus. It's worth 50 cents. And it is what it is. Let's look at the actual device. What do you think? Ready for this? I'm ready. Okay. I'm going to set this cheap little flimsy stand over here, which actually is pretty good, but it is what it is. It's not the selling point. Here is the selling point, my friends. This is a Q7 from Jabiz. And this device has what? AC input. Ooh. We're talking, this is not like a USB hub. This is not sharing many, many you know, scanners into your computer. This is specifically plug it in and start charging your devices. Okay. Now, you already noticed, Jeff, that we've got six ports. Now, you'll notice the discoloration of the top one. Yes. This is a 10-watt uh, a port. All the rest of them are 40-watt ports. Now, the device itself, the Q7, will do up to 50 watts simultaneously. So what that means is if you plug in uh, several devices, it's going to share the wattage with many different devices. So keep in mind, 10 watts, this top port, is about what you get with a, like an iPad charger. Two, yeah, yeah, okay. Two amps or so. Yep. So all of these are actually four times the power as far as wattage goes. Um, and they have, what did I mention at the top here? Quick charge. What that means is that in about 15 minutes time, you're going to be able to charge your phone. Uh, if it's got that quick charge feature, it, you're going to be able to charge your phone and get about eight hours battery life. With just 15, a 15 minute 15 charge. minutes, really? Yeah. Yeah. It's wow. awesome. So... The other thing, so you think, okay, well, I've got, I've got a couple of old phones and I've got a couple of new things. I've got an iPad or a tablet or something. My iPad has quick charge. My phone does not. What happens if I plug them all in together? Now, it has some safety features. Maybe we can kind of just go over a couple of those, Jeff, because I've, I've listed them out. So safety features go. Okay. Oh, you're, you're not going to take it. Oh, sorry. I thought you said... <laughs> <laughs> I'm like hinting, Jeff, come on. Help me out here, man. I even gave you a printout. <laughs> okay, so here's the... I, I was slightly distracted by the, the ticker feed on the newsroom. Or not the newsroom. Oh, the, down the, below the you feed. can actually... <laughs> yeah. This is the first night that we've ever been able to see you, chat room. Yeah. Obvious. I feel like this is a, like an infomercial or something where I'm intentionally... It is exactly it yeah. like an infomercial. <laughs> right, YouTube? <laughs> right? <laughs> okay, so what am I talking about? Uh, the pie killer. <laughs> the Q7 from Javis. Oh, yeah. All right, six which may actually power a Raspberry Pi 3. 
Okay, where, where, where Pr- protects, are we? Pr- protects against overcharging. Thank you, Sasha. Overcurrent. <laughs> if overheating. you've got overcurrent, overheating, oh, short yeah. Short circuiting and over voltage. So it's got you covered, actually. It's got you covered. And if you plug in multiple different devices that are drawing different amperage, um, it will actually automatically adjust the ports as you plug them in. Right. Instantaneously, and you charge everything all at once. Now, I know that uh, Jabiz does quality products, and so yeah. they've got all their certification, FCC, and all that, correct? This is 100% certified and guaranteed. So okay. we've got uh, ROHS, we've got CE, and we've got uh, FCC certification on this. And if Excellent. you're unhappy with it, they'll actually give you your money back. Feel that. It's actually kind of surprising. That is solid. Yeah. See, uh, as you were hol- holding it up there, yeah. I'm looking at it going, hmm. Right on my nightstand, and of yeah. course, anybody who cares about like waves when you sleep and how it affects you, they're going to be like, ah, Jeff. Electromagnetic but, stuff? Yeah, yeah. Okay. But I'm sitting there going, okay, there's my work phone, <clears throat> my personal phone, my tablet, my House of Marley headphones. Yeah, and, all in one fell swoop. And my, um, my watch. I'm thinking, there you go. Because I've got a power bar plus all these cables. Oh, this wow. This would be so much nicer. Are you using a bunch of wall warts for that? Um, yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, just cables everywhere. Mm-hmm. It's brutal. So, that's about- exactly the same setup I have. A power bar with all yeah. different chargers on them, and oh, then man. I plug This will in. be amazing. And Do you my guys phone, see how clean that is? Yeah, my phone so. is a quick charge, so, I mean, that speaks to me completely. There you go. So yeah. imagine, yeah, there you go. That feature is there. Um, I mean, it is what it is. It's a very simple product from a promotional standpoint, you know, what I can tell you about it, but it works. It's great. Uh, in the box... Beyond that, let's see, we've got, I'll now this you. is the American style uh, AC adapter. Uh, of course, you can get um, the, the UK uh, different adapter as well. And there you go. Oh, and those tr- straps for holding so, your oh, cables Oh, look at that. It's even got some cable, um, like, like wraps or whatever yeah. to kind of keep everything nice and neat. So they've thought of it all. I mean, it's, it is what it is, and it's fantastic. No, this is just a six-port charger. It's yeah. not a... Battery. It's not a hub. It's not okay. no. It's not a battery. Um, it does not do anything like that. It is strictly something that you would plug in, and it gives you power. Right. Yeah. Uh, but as I mentioned, you could power a Raspberry Pi or six of them with this. <laughs> Definitely five because we've got the five forty amp, uh, forty watt, forty amp, forty <laughs> forty watt uh, ports It'll there. Blow it up. I, I, it might be a fun experiment. Let's see how many Raspberry Pis uh, we can power with that. That would be kind of neat. Uh, See, and right in my head, I'm starting to think like multiplicity. I'm picturing a power bar with all these plugged in and just devices. <laughs> We're going to make a server farm, farm of Raspberry Pi. <laughs> <Exactly. please. laughs>